Good afternoon, my name is Gary. Um, I have a security company in Barnsley, South Yorkshire. I want to talk to you today about an Optima XM 4 zone control panel. Um, I've just removed this one. Um, it works perfectly, it's just an upgrade. I want to tell you about how to reset the NVM on this um, control panel. It still works, as I say. It's a, it's a really good panel. It, it, it was good in its days. And if it's still working, uh, you know, it was built to last. And it's on eBay at the moment. Um, it's actually selling. It should be sold in about five hours or so. Um, anyway, how to reset the NVM. Remove battery. Remove the 240 volt supply. I would suggest taking a photo of the wiring connections and put a bit of tape around the cables and mark zone one, zone two, PA and so on and make sure that you've got them all in the right order. So you need to remove every single one of these. You don't need to remove the um, speaker, that's not necessary, but you do need to remove everyone else. Then you would connect a piece of um, low voltage alarm wire and you would connect it to number nine on the um, connection here and to number 19. You would then power it up by the mains. What would happen then, all these lights would light up and you get a, you get a little um, tone from the control panel. Then you need to reconnect each and every one of your zones and your PA and your tamper circuits, your bell box. Then reconnect the uh, battery put the lid back on, screw it back down, and then you would press reset. Now, if you reset it, everything should go off and it will revert back then to the factory setting, um, which would be zero, one, two, three, which is, I've done this today on this one, so it, it is working absolutely fine. Um, but if you have a light on, say a tamper or something like that, or a PA, what you would need to do is go back and just check your tamper here, check the PA, and check your tamper on your belt, just to make sure that the cables are in firmly. Um, and that's how to factory reset a Optima XM. Thank you very much for watching the videos. Give me a thumbs up. I don't do that many videos, but I'm trying. I hope this helps you. Thank you. Take care now.